Guys, today, March 17th, Apple had their March 17th release event, and the big thing today was the iPhone 3.0 firmware update. And this firmware update is going to be for the iPod Touches and the iPhones. And there's going to be a lot of really good software updates that everybody's been waiting for for a long time. Like, um, number one, like one of the really big things, especially for iPhone users, MMS messaging, so you, now you can multimedia message, so now you can send video files, audio files, locations from like Google Maps, places, things like that, pictures, um, stuff like that. Wait, no, I take that back. I don't think it's video messaging. But um, also, search your iPhone, search your device. This is for uh, iPod Touches also. It's going to be really like a spotlight, like on the Macs. You can use your spotlight to search your entire computer. Whereas on the iPhone or iPod Touch, you should be able to use it and you could see your entire, all, you can search through contacts, mail, song listings, pictures, probably you might be able to put tags on pictures and stuff like that. So that's really good. Another thing, especially, um, for, especially for iPhone but also iPod Touch users, um, read and compose email and text messages in landscape. So basically now there's landscape texting and emailing. So now you can use your keyboard in landscape mode not only for Safari but for the other applications that you can type with. <clears throat> That's really handy, that'd be really nice to be able to text in landscape I think. Also, um, copy, paste, and cut. Now officially, Apple official in the iPhone 3.0 firmware. Um, that's coming out. And I also heard, I'm not sure I'm reading some of the stuff right now. From what I heard, you should be able to use, um, there should be um, official video recording now. So you don't have to go in and jailbreak it and get a video like a psych order. Really good application, but now more people do it because a lot of people are afraid to jailbreak. I don't know why. It's perfectly harmless. And, um, <clears throat> but right now, the iPhone OS 3.0 is technically out and available if you are the paid Apple developer. If you paid your $99 or $299 for an enterprise account, $99 for a standard account, I'm too cheap and I can't code well enough to do that. So I don't have access to the iPhone 3.0 SDK nor the iPhone OS 3.0 beta firmware. I am desperately searching the inner tubes for you guys to be able to find that and use it and review it and maybe have it available to you guys. I don't know how legal that is at all but it is going to be officially released this summer probably around july 11th just like all the other apple releases so guys stay out there i will keep you updated comment rate and subscribe bye